20 kilos, sorry. Just hold that. <laughs> oh Christ! No he was way. Carrying, he was just carrying no that way. around. Everywhere, every day. <laughs> I can't even carry it. If you're here, suddenly look how much bigger and stronger I look there, yeah. then we're going to be halfway, top position, then just into one hand. Can we just, sorry. Like, I would, if I was looking at that, I would say it was like a three year transformation. That is That's ridiculous. January. January. That's and so crazy. The bit that was so crazy to me is that at the beginning of this year, I wasn't coaching all that much here. I was kind of really busy opening couple model coaching online. So I knew you to some degree before this. I didn't even recognize that first photo. It got sent in our team group. Know it was. And that you first like, well, they sent the first photo came through and I was like, I have no idea who that is. That's 20 kilos, sorry. Just hold that. <laughs> oh Christ! No he was way. Carrying, he was just carrying no that way. around. Everywhere, every day. <laughs> That's how much you've lost. Come back how in. mental is that? I've, I've been wearing a vest made of pull-ups, 20 kilogram pull-ups, and I'm like, how do I even manage that? How does that come off in, in body weight? That makes no sense, does it? When you see it like that and you hold it. It was the same with yours, wasn't it? I couldn't pick mine up. 20 kilos. 20 kilos. It's like, there's no wonder I couldn't do pull-ups. I could, I could <laughs> exactly. bang out like 12, 13 now. Exactly, imagine. I put it's not just that, it's just carrying, yeah. carrying that around all day long. You know what? I thought I was fit as well. There she is. Okay, this. Yeah. This is another oh, absolutely insane transformation that I have to share with you and show you. How uh, how much weight are we down? Now. 56 pounds. Jesus. Crazy. And here she is. Looking absolutely oh. amazing. When did you join? When did you start? End of January. End of Jan. Wow. End of Jan. That's massive, isn't it? That's yeah. so huge. So we have a mix. So all the transformations you've seen today are a mix of my one body athletic members here in Sheffield at our gym. So Tatiana is a member of our gym here in Sheffield. And then we have our online clients, which are just based wherever. But you're a member of the gym. So how have you found it? How have you found working with one body Brilliant. Brilliant. I don't think so. I would have done it myself. Even yeah. being sporty a lot, but COVID didn't help. For sure. Being a mom, staying at home, always. That is nice. Same as your, your transformation video, like 35,000 oh. views in the first Did it? hour. Well, when I made myself this morning, <coughs> 64 pounds down now. 64, 64 pounds? 11 Jeez. stone 7 this morning. Holy cow. That's nuts. That's so crazy. I like to show. Yeah, I, like, I like to show. I'm gonna say I like to show people that because when you're shooting, you don't realize yourself at all how insane you look. We posted his transformation video, kind of from week one. When was week one, Jan? January, February. It's January, wasn't it? So what's it been? Six months, seven months? About eight months, I think. See, that's the, I think that's the thing. I think the best transformations, or the, the quality of the transformations, are always going to be the ones that have been that little bit longer. Yeah, I, think yeah. you could, I think you could speed rush them, someone through a six week, or a 12 week, or a 20 week, but you run the risk of losing loads of muscle, of which you haven't. I think you've grown muscle through this process, if anything. But the quality, and that crazy level of condition, that's going to come with time. And we've had time on our side, so it's good. But yeah, we posted his, we posted his transformation video. In an hour, it had 60k views, which is just unheard of on my socials. One of those things, because I know you've been doing it for a while, haven't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it one of those things, like, once you start, you, you don't want to stop once almost? Once you start, yeah, you feel like... For me, seeing all the weight come off, I'm like, yeah, that's it. I want to keep going, keep going, keep going. Like, you don't want to, do you know what I mean? Once you've done it, you don't want to put a ridiculous amount of weight on it. 100%. Like, 
to it all again mm -hmm. now. And and I think that's where he'll be at now. Now he's done it, he'll just stay. Yeah, the hips coming out, the hips are not stopped coming out this morning. Uh, I started 12 weeks ago. I uh, started 12 weeks ago, took it serious around eight weeks ago because um, I sort of like were like failing a bit the first four weeks, uh, doing my own thing, and then I it like got to me that I thought I'm right, taking it serious now. Um, yeah, good mate. Good. good. So probably a solid eight week. So we went. We've gone through obviously many many preps with Dane, and this time around it was they weren't. You weren't. You weren't even, even going to do it. Was you? No, you weren't. You wasn't going to do it. And then about <laughs> four weeks out, you start to see everybody dialing into crazy shape. Was like, right, I'm going to do it. Just let's do it. Let's see how far yeah. we can take it. So we've had a, we've had three or four weeks to try and pull things in a little bit, but. Six pounds. As, abs pop up, you know, as much as anything, you support for calves, so calves, Dane's brother, and this is the first time of him really training, doing any of this properly, so. What's everybody thought? What's everybody, what's the, what's the family, friends, what people say? It's a bit funny really, because you get, a mixed, you get a mixed opinion, don't you? Yeah, in the beginning, like no one really understands. Yeah. And then until they've seen the condition in the last two weeks, like, oh, I knew you, knew you'd be working so hard. They're all jumping on it now. It's like, I was going to say, you've had loads of support on your Facebook. Yeah. I saw that, which was really like, cool. I'm quite independent, so I've just kept it over myself and yeah, yeah, just kept it under wraps. And I knew what I kept people were doing, especially, you know, to see you on with your guidance. So I thought, keep my head down, keep going, and then, Praise everyone kind of thing. So it was day day one of carving up. Yeah. But I say day one, it was three hours into day one. <laughs> so what day was this? This was Sunday night. Thursday morning. So Wednesday night, the carve up's due to start on Thursday. Thursday at 3 a.m. Paul had had two of his carb meals already, like it was fucking Christmas to him. So you'd had the oats, you'd had the cocoa pops. Yeah, and, and then you had the, the bagels. <laughs> Bagels for like after afterwards, and yeah. it took. I didn't even get like two o'clock. It was so us. funny. I woke up to the messages that he'd already had two of the meals at 3 a.m. That must have been a long ass day. Mate, Friday got worse. Wow. Tom, bam. Is it like 50 pounds in the end? Yeah, about just under. Just under 50 pounds from double chin to absolute jawline. <laughs> Mate, you width of your back, your delts, your abs come in. Exactly. I mean, like I say, it's just a tip of the iceberg, yeah, it's this. this. Tip of the iceberg. I, it's funny because we had the conversation, we've said this a few times, but yeah. right at the beginning, I was like, let's take it easy. I don't want to push it too far. I want to make sure that this is sustainable. And he was like, no, let's go for it. If we're going to do it, I want to do it. I want to do it right. I want to see how far I can take it. Have you ever seen a more consistent weight loss <laughs> than that? All the way down, starting from 108 kilo down to 87.5. Just consistent. Consistency personified. That is ridiculous. What size are they? These are 38. And what are you now? I was in 34s, but I'm down to 32s. So yeah, easily 32s yeah. now. Crazy. That is crazy. 20 weeks. 20 weeks, is that it? Yeah. Yes, that's so good. <laughs> I love it. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, I'll share, I'll share them out, don't worry. I think that's a big part that people need to understand is when you are going to go through something like this, your partner needs to be on board. Like, this is where you realise whether or not you have a supportive partner. Because it's taxing, it's hard, a lot of sacrifice that goes into it. And if your partner isn't supportive, well then A, you've probably not got a good partner. But B, you're going to struggle because you're always going to have that resistance and it's so, so difficult. So I always talk so much about controlling your environment. It's so important. The people you surround yourself with, your friends, your family, the environments you put yourself in, it's all got to be controlled because if it's not and you're constantly in environments that are detrimental towards what you want to achieve, you're going to struggle. It's going to be hard. Just on there with the abs nice and tight. Bring it down about here. Maybe down here like this. Exhale hard yes, Joey. Fuck. Don't forget to tense his biceps as well. Exhale, exhale, exhale. Stephanie's next Tinder profile. <laughs> 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 it's a long 14-week shoot just for a Tinder profile. <laughs> so we shot. So we shot yesterday. Yeah. And my my guy Lewis. It was like, oh, what are you gonna have? What's the first big meal? He was like, 
I was thinking of McDonald's. I was like, no, you're on diet all this time. I, said, to have I, said, a I feel my intuition of like, okay, I'll, I'll not be in the middle hole, so like, I'll see what's there. <laughs> can't do McDonald's. It might be. It it can't be McDonald's. McDonald's. <laughs> That's I'm so. I'm not going to lie to you. I might chicken be... nugs or burger, like. Well, I'm getting a chicken burger tonight. <laughs> exactly. So I might just get a. But a this was the funny part. So Lewis was like, so what are you going to have? He's like, oh, I don't know. I've, I've, been, I've been eyeing up this uh, Spanish fiesta, like this new thing. I was like, you're even going to risk it and have something that you don't already know. Flashback. We have that new Spanish burger. <laughs> oh, oh, I think that's risky. I think it's risky. It's not sticking to what yeah. you know. Like, if you like getting that, that'd be big fat <laughs> End of flashback. Put everybody together. Make sure we push in as it looks best on the camera. All right, I'm gonna do one more and just like I don't know. You could throw your arms up if you want to do whatever. Should do a bicep. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, Josh is gonna do that. Do it. Three, two, one. Is that the same can or the second can? It's actually the same can. <laughs> oh! Don't 